Welcome to DK Web Design Studio. Today we're going to look at how to create a banner on your website using Wix that would have scrolling text. Uh, not necessarily a horizontal scroll, but perhaps a fade in and fade out type of scroll. So this is a pretty nifty, easy way to capture somebody's attention when they come to your website and we're going to go through it the easy way on Wix. So the first thing you're going to do is go to your the top of your page, let's say it's your landing page, perhaps it's your home page, and we're going to put in a banner. So hitting the add button on the left. So come down to where it says interactive and we're going to select actually, we're going to scroll down a little bit and pick this about detailed interactive banner. And I'm just going to click, drag and drop it towards the top. Make sure that it's all the way pressed against the margin. And then what we're going to do is if we can customize each of these slides, let's say we want to, um, maybe we can say welcome to our site. And then we might have something interesting here saying, um, this is where it all begins, dot, dot, dot. All right, and then you can have a button, take out the button, customize this however you want, change the font, change the sizes. Um, just as an example here, we're gonna pick a different, a different type of font, make it a little bit larger. There you go. All right, next slide. So as you can see, this is there's multiple slides here. We can add more slides, take away the slides, and there's a slide manager over here. Um, so here we can actually duplicate the slide, duplicate the slide. All right, and then we'll delete slide two, and we'll delete slide three. So now we have three of the same slides, same background. And this is important because if we go to copy slide one, um, Hello again, move this up, move that up, all right, and let's go to the next one, let's say goodbye, all right, so all I'm doing here is I want to have three identical banners, and the reason why is once we come to the setting button, I'll show you what to do here. So on the settings, we have autoplay upon loading, three seconds between the slides, um, stop on hover or we take that out. And well, let's keep that on. What I want to do is do a crossfade. So right now there's horizontal. Every time that it changes slide to slide, it's going horizontal. We want to do a crossfade and that's going to make it achieve the effect that we're looking for. So let's go ahead and test this out and see what what that did. Hover it over it, move away. There you go. So as you can see, now the banner is constant at the top and every time the text is changing, um, the banner or the background stays the same. So this is a really neat, nice way to have some slides at the beginning of your website. Um, and it's one way to achieve it. Hope this video was helpful. Um, subscribe to my channel. Leave me a comment below. And looking forward to the next time.